shot Holy stuff. Shit. Buff up. Woo! Oh my, oh my god. god. I did look at the solar eclipse six and a half years ago. I closed my right eye and I stared at the sun for a good like 15 seconds. Didn't think anything of it not an issue. The very next day I woke up and I opened up my left eye to read on my phone and I couldn't read every other word. It there was like a there was like a blind spot on every other word that I was reading. There is no damage that was done to my cornea. We've done all of it, but there was some damage that was done to something <laughs> in which certain parts of my eyes distorted. So I actually now have slow 2020 vision because I stood at the solar eclipse without the glasses for 10 seconds. Yes, before we go into this, just take a look at this. But the police wants you to leave. Yes? Mm -hmm. I'm not going. We are staying here because we know what is at stake and we are not going to give up. Yes, I've been saying this, that this lady is clueless. Some people will batch at me on the comment section. When you take a look at this article, the view course gets cool for Thai eclipse to climate change. The view Sonny Austin try connecting solar eclipse, earthquakes, and the periodic emergence of Sikhane to climate change on Monday, prompting the show co-host to openly call her out over the mind boggling claim. School closing and some folks even warning that it's a sign from God. Oh, really? What do you think about today's solar event? That well, it's strictly science, it, it, one. <laughs> well, I was gonna say PSA, you can't see a darn thing. You no. can't see anything. So normal sunglasses will not cut it. Get no, your safety no, you goggles. Not yeah. wear it. Listen, do not, okay, let's be really let, clear. <laughs> yeah. Unless you know that the glasses you have are eclipse. Yeah. Are e eclipse glasses, do not put them on yeah. to look at the sun. Because you can't see anything. Pa and, and it, and it doesn't even light. matter that you can't see anything, but it will blind you because yeah. you're not, you, you don't do it. Yes. Don't well, do Donald it. Trump didn't yeah. get blind and he did it. He no, is blind. So a fascinating thing yes. is it does the damage, yeah. but you don't feel it because of mm -hmm. just how powerful it is. Can I know Maybe one that's what's wrong with him. Maybe that maybe explains some things. Yeah. So what's kind of crazy is with the earthquake on Friday and then the eclipse today, People are having all sorts of conspiracies about the end of the world. And then I read online that the earthquake epicenter was actually at Bedminster in New Jersey. Right. Yes. Fun fact. I, so it originated with Trump. I, have to, I, I know, right? I mean, I have to say, um, Karen Dupiche, our, our wonderful, oh one of my our gosh. wonderful makeup artist, when the earthquake was happening, she put her coat on and she was like, Jesus is coming. I'm so out. I'm, I'm out. I'm leaving. We've got a solar eclipse. Uh, we've she got the earthquake. The she ran down the hallway. <laughs> the rapture then, is here. The rapture is here. And then also, I learned that the cicadas are coming. Cicadas. Cicadas. Although I love for the, the first time in cicada, cicada. like no, 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 two different, no, two, no, well, they, this is what I read. There's two, two different there's times. There's two different kinds of cicadas. Yes, two different coming. times. Times are coming. The good cicadas but, and the bad. But no. for the first time <clears throat> in in many many years. No, seven every seventeen years this happens. Well, that's not what I read, but maybe you know, maybe you know better I, but in I a way say all those all those things together would maybe lead one to believe that you know either climate change exists that's more or something point. is really going going on. returning earthquakes are not at the mercy of climate change it's underground no. it can't I don't it, think it, that's it happens How and, the and the, the eclipse they've known about the eclipse coming because eclipses happen and they actually can say when these things are going to happen so all these folks who are saying you know it's a sign from god god doesn't give you warning <laughs> okay, you think he gave people at the Tower of Babel warning? Oh, I'm about to jack y'all up. <laughs> no, God does stuff, and then you figure, oh, that's probably because I just. Uh. <laughs> you know, I mean, it's no. But the cicadas come. We have them every 17 years. There's some we get every 20 some odd years, and they just go under, and they come back up. What and now there's two, they make they noise swarm. and have sex. And, and, sing. and this time, both types yeah. are coming. They have no, sex? Yes. They make, what, what's they the make noise? They make new cicadas with gold. 
Now, the next time that somebody tells me that they're scared to let me down, I'll just remind them that I went through the 2024 solar eclipse, specifically in Houston. Little did I know that this would be the biggest celestial blue ball that I've ever experienced in my life and probably ever will. For those of y'all who were afraid of missing out of a once in a lifetime event, being that only the fourth of America got to see it, I promise you didn't miss anything. Matter of fact, let me include a video right here. Big ass cloud getting in the way, bro. Oh my gosh. Man, damn. Oh, I even work to see this shit. Now, I wasn't even going to touch too much on this topic, but I feel really disrespected. We haven't had an overcast really in weeks. And now on the day of the major solar eclipse, we have the darkest clouds coming about and just blocking every single potential moment to see the eclipse happening in action because it's only happening for like three or four minutes. Don't worry about burning your corneas because it's not even a possibility when you can't even see the solar eclipse. So, uh, yeah, you don't have to worry about that, at least not here in Houston, Texas. The only theory that proved itself true was that they're only trying to sell these glasses and make a cash grab off of these glasses and to make a cash grab off of... You you know people making an event out of this people going to picnics buying food you know driving traffic to industries that can profit off of a solar eclipse because this yes, i say this frequent there is one thing people don't understand you don't just say things if you have less knowledge reasons i don't react or say things on videos i know less so now i was claiming to know everything i'm a legal scholar i'm this you know that has always been her you know point of view in every situation, you know, came up with this bogus claim, like, you know, earthquakes are just caused by, you know, climate change. It is ridiculous to even think like that. If you want to talk about earthquakes, you know, talking about plate tectonics, you know, things like this, you will not see any link. That is according to my own beliefs. I don't want to go into the science or climate change. You know, these people believe in that. There are certain things I disagree with them in so many occasions. Now going into eclipse, we knew that this will happen at this particular time. I want to know why Sonny Austin will get up to make this claim. Is it that she is just not knowledgeable on things like this or what exactly when you take a look at this meanwhile google pointed out that they have known about the eclipse coming because eclipse happened and they actually can say when these things are going to happen adding that she also doesn't believe this event aside from god google also reiterated that periodical seeker consistently consistently suffers during the same cycle regardless of the climate quickly moving the conversation past Austin embarrassing assertions co Sarah said it's great to see the coverage on news of something that everyone can get excited about regarding the eclipse okay they all just realize she is not intelligent enough to even comment on this so that person is doing a lot. Sometimes when I see this ridiculous take, I don't even want to react. I decided to bring this so you can see exactly what is going on. When I put out the view video, I always see people saying, oh, you know, don't react, don't watch these people. I always try to cut out just some part and watch the rest for you so we can watch and laugh. Reason, I call them cackling the view. I want to appreciate people, you know, standing up, supporting this channel, sharing out videos. God bless you.